Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of the YouTube world, CJ Rose is back in the building. Welcome back to the channel. All right, next matchup on the SummerSlam 2022 card was Logan Paul versus The Miz. Now, I didn't say this in my reaction. I'm sorry, my predictions video. I didn't say it in my prediction video or anything, but honestly, I didn't care about this match. I didn't. I didn't care about this match. I wasn't thinking about this match. Actually, you could tell because I think in my prediction video, I didn't really have, I didn't know what who to pick as a winner. So I was like, hey, Logan Paul, The Miz, like it was hard to really choose. But I guess in some sense, that's me not really caring about this match. So, yeah. <laughs> And as the match continued going, I still didn't care. <laughs> I, said, I still didn't care. I still didn't feel any way. Now, there was something that people were saying about this. And I think Simon, I think Simon said in his prediction video for World Culture, I think he said, actually, I don't think he said it, but some people did say that they wanted to see Champa just turn his back on the Miz. And then, boom, right there, Champa is just his own man after that. Which now, if you really think about it, you know, since Triple H just had a creative and Triple H adores the hell out of Champa, you would think that you would think that it's time to move Champa away from the Miz because that's not really going to do anything for Champa. It's not. Not at all. So... I think everybody wanted to see that, and you got the opposite. <laughs> you got totally the opposite, but we'll see. How, we'll see as time goes on. Um, turns in the match. Um, I mean, don't get me wrong. I mean, at WrestleMania, Logan Paul did have a have a good showing. You know, so I'm, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say and say I don't think Logan Paul was gonna not perform here. I don't think he was not gonna do his best here. But, you know, he, he when I tell you Logan Paul tried to find everything in the world he could do, he tried. <laughs> he tried. Elite frogs, uh, moonsault off the apron, shit, flying cross bodies, taking part, taking a couple other people's moves, all that. Further into the match, uh, Champa. Look like he's about to interfere in something, but he didn't do anything. But you know, you know how this is when the, the somebody just gets on the apron and the referee sees them and the guy's like, oh, I didn't do nothing. Then the ref will go, you know what? You're out of here. You're causing a distraction. Yeah, that's pretty much what this was. <laughs> uh, he, ref felt Champa was about to be a distraction. Champa was like, Champa was like, I didn't do anything. You know, you know, not a typical bad guy just gets mad at it. Instead, in this case, Champa comes back, gets a chair, sets it up, and then sits on it and says, I'm not going anywhere. I'm not going anywhere. Then AJ Styles music plays, but the camera never pans to the entranceway. So he never makes his way. But we're still hitting his theme. But it's like, where the hell is AJ? Where's AJ? So you see a the left corner of your screen, AJ Styles comes in, boom, hits Champa with a with a um a double axe handle, and then pretty much just takes out Champa as they fight in a crowd and everything. So boom, it was just one on one, Logan Paul versus the Miz. So Logan Paul then proceeds to just tear up the announce table, put the Miz on it, looks at Maurice, tells her Look at what I'm about to do to your husband. Then does a pretty a pretty decent frog splash. Pretty decent frog splash. Gotta give it to him. So look pretty alright. Now before then, before then, uh Logan Paul also hit a phenomenal forearm, which I'm not gonna lie to you, was probably the worst phenomenal forearm I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> that thing looked stiff, it looked bad, it didn't look good at all. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm gonna tell you that that phenomenal form was not phenomenal. 
I don't think it was a farm either. I don't know what the hell he did. He just springboard. Springboard just did just like an elbow, like a springboard elbow, pretty much. So Maurice was um causing a distraction to Logan Paul. Then the Miz grabs this uh one of one photo. I guess it's in like a I think it's like an NFT. That what that what the NFT is? I think that's what the NFT is. I'm not sure, but it was like in a I guess in a glass case, a hard glass case. So he picked it up. He was about to hit Logan Paul with it. Logan Paul ducks out. And he was about to hit Maurice, but he stops. Maurice gets off the apron. You know, falls, dramatic, whatever. Then Logan Paul comes from behind, hits Miz with his own skull crushing finale, and gets the win off that. I did not think he would win off the skull crushing finale. I did not think he went off anything else that was not his own, or whatever the case was. But yeah, uh, Logan Paul wins. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know what happens after this. I'm not sure, but uh, I guess we'll find out on Raw, probably, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> All right, next match. Let's get it.